Social work is an academic discipline and profession that concerns itself with individuals, families, groups and communities in an effort to enhance health and social functioning and overall well-being. Social functioning refers to the way in which people perform their social roles, and the structural institutions that are provided to sustain them. Social work applies social sciences, such as sociology, psychology, political science, public health, community development, law, and economics, to engage with client systems, conduct assessments, and develop interventions to solve social and personal problems, and create social change. Social work practice is often divided into micro work, which involves working directly with individuals or small groups, and macro work, which involves working communities, and within social policy, to create change on a larger scale. Social work developed in the 19th century, with roots in voluntary philanthropy and grassroots organizing. However, the act of responding to social needs have existed long before then, primarily from private charities and religious organizations. The effects of the Industrial Revolution and the Great Depression placed pressure on social work to be a more defined discipline. Definition Social work is a broad profession that intersects with several disciplines. Social work organizations offer the following definitions – Social work is a practice-based profession and an academic discipline that promotes social change and development, social cohesion, and the empowerment and liberation of people. Principles of social justice, human rights, collective responsibility and respect for diversities are central to social work. Underpinned by theories of social work, social sciences, humanities and indigenous knowledge, social work engages people and structures to address life challenges and enhance well-being. International Federation of Social Workers. Social work is a profession concerned with helping individuals, families, groups and communities to enhance their individual and collective well-being. It aims to help people develop their skills and their ability to use their own resources and those of the community to resolve problems. Social work is concerned with individual and personal problems but also with broader social issues such as poverty, unemployment, and domestic violence. Canadian Association of Social Workers Social work practice consists of the professional application of social work values, principles, and techniques to one or more of the following ends, helping people obtain tangible services, counseling and psychotherapy with individuals, families, and groups, helping communities or groups provide or improve social and health services, and participating in legislative processes. The practice of social work requires knowledge of human development and behavior, of social and economic, and cultural institutions, and of the interaction of all these factors." National Association of Social Workers Social workers work with individuals and families to help improve outcomes in their lives. This may be helping to protect vulnerable people from harm or abuse or supporting people to live independently. Social workers support people, act as advocates and direct people to the services they may require. Social workers often work in multidisciplinary teams alongside health and education professionals. British Association of Social Workers History The practice and profession of social work has a relatively modern and scientific origin, and is generally considered to have developed out of three strands. The first was individual casework, a strategy pioneered by the Charity Organization Society in the mid-19th century, which was founded by Helen Bozenke and Octavia Hill in London, England. Most historians identify CUS as the pioneering organization of the social theory that led to the emergence of social work as a professional occupation. CUS had its main focus on individual casework. The second was social administration, which included various forms of poverty relief, relief of paupers. Statewide poverty relief could be said to have its roots in the English poor laws of the 17th century, but was first systematized through the efforts of the Charity Organization Society. The third consisted of social action, rather than engaging in the resolution of immediate individual requirements, the emphasis was placed on political action working through the community and the group to improve their social conditions and thereby alleviate poverty. This approach was developed originally by the Settlement House movement, this was accompanied by a less easily defined movement, the development of institutions to deal with the entire range of social problems. 
All had their most rapid growth during the 19th century, and laid the foundation basis for modern social work, both in theory and in practice. Professional social work originated in 19th century England, and had its roots in the social and economic upheaval wrought by the Industrial Revolution, in particular the societal struggle to deal with the resultant mass urban based poverty and its related problems. Because poverty was the main focus of early social work, it was intricately linked with the idea of charity work. Other important historical figures that shaped the growth of the social work profession are Jane Addams, who founded the Hull House in Chicago and won the Nobel Peace Prize in 1931, Mary Ellen Richmond, who wrote Social Diagnosis, one of the first social work books to incorporate law, medicine, psychiatry, psychology, and history, and William Beveridge, who created the social welfare state, framing the debate on social work within the context of social welfare provision. Transtheoretical models Social work is an interdisciplinary profession, meaning it draws from a number of areas, such as but not limited to psychology, sociology, politics, criminology, economics, ecology, education, health, law, philosophy, anthropology, and counseling, including psychotherapy. Field work is a distinctive attribution to social work pedagogy. This equips the trainee in understanding the theories and models within the field of work. Professional practitioners from multicultural aspects have their roots in this social work immersion engagements from the early 19th century in the Western countries. As an example, here are some of the models and theories used within social work practice. Topic: Profession Abraham Flexner in a 1915 lecture, "'Is Social Work a Profession?' delivered at the National Conference on Charities and Corrections, examined the characteristics of a profession with reference to social work. It is not a single model, such as that of health, followed by medical professions such as nurses and doctors, but an integrated profession, and the likeness with medical profession is that social work requires a continued study for professional development to retain knowledge and skills that are evidence-based by practice standards. A social work professional's services lead toward the aim of providing beneficial services to individuals, dyads, families, groups, organizations, and communities to achieve optimum psychosocial functioning. Its seven core functions are described by Popple and Leininger as Engagement the social worker must first engage the client in early meetings to promote a collaborative relationship. Assessment data must be gathered that will guide and direct a plan of action to help the client. Planning negotiate and formulate an action plan implementation promote resource acquisition and enhance role performance monitoring evaluation ongoing documentation through short term goal attainment of extent to which client is following through supportive counseling affirming challenging encouraging informing and exploring options graduated disengagement Seeking to replace the social worker with a naturally occurring resource Six other core values identified by the National Association of Social Workers Code of Ethics are Service — help people in need and address social problems Social justice — challenge social injustices Respect the dignity and worth of the person Give importance to human relationships Integrity — behave in a trustworthy manner Competence — practice within the areas of one's areas of expertise and develop and enhance professional skill A historic and defining feature of social work is the profession's focus on individual well-being in a social context and the well-being of society. Social workers promote social justice and social change with and on behalf of clients. A client can be an individual, family, group, organization, or community. In the broadening scope of the modern social worker's role, some practitioners have in recent years traveled to war torn countries to provide psychosocial assistance to families and survivors. Newer areas of social work practice involve management science. The growth of social work administration for transforming social policies into services and directing activities of an organization toward achievement of goals is a related field. 
helping clients with accessing benefits such as unemployment insurance and disability benefits, to assist individuals and families in building savings and acquiring assets to improve their financial security over the long term, to manage large operations, etc. requires social workers to know financial management skills to help clients and organizations to be financially self sufficient. Financial social work also helps clients with low income or low to middle income, people who are either unbanked do not have a banking account or underbanked individuals who have a bank account but tend to rely on high-cost non-bank providers for their financial transactions, with better mediation with financial institutions and induction of money management skills. Another area that social workers are focusing is risk management. Risk in social work is taken as night in 1921 defined. If you don't even know for sure what will happen, but you know the odds, that is risk and if you don't even know the odds, that is uncertainty. Risk management in social work means minimizing the risks while increasing potential benefits for clients by analyzing the risks and benefits in duty of care or in decisions. In the United States, according to the Substance Abuse and Mental Health Services Administration, a branch of the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services, professional social workers are the largest group of mental health services providers. There are more clinically trained social workers over 200,000 than psychiatrists, psychologists, and psychiatric nurses combined. Federal law and the National Institutes of Health recognize social work as one of five core mental health professions. Examples of fields a social worker may be employed in are poverty relief, life skills education, community development, rural development, forensics and corrections, legislation, industrial relations, project management, child protection, elder protection, women's rights, human rights, systems optimization, finance, addictions rehabilitation, child development, cross cultural mediation, occupational safety safety and health, disaster management, mental health, psychosocial therapy, disabilities, etc. Qualifications The education of social workers begins with a bachelor's degree BA, BSC, BSSW, BSW, etc. or diploma in social work or a bachelor of social services. Some countries offer postgraduate degrees in social work, such as a master's degree MSW, MSSW, MSS, MSSA, MA, MSC, MREs, MPhil, or doctoral studies PhD and DSW Doctor of Social Work. Increasingly, graduates of social work programs pursue post-masters and postdoctoral study, including training in psychotherapy. In the United States, social work undergraduate and master's programs are accredited by the Council on Social Work Education. A CSWE accredited degree is required for one to become a state licensed social worker. The CSWE even accredits online masters in social work programs in traditional and advanced standing options. In 1898, the New York Charity Organization Society, which was the Columbia University School of Social Work's earliest entity, began offering formal, "...social philanthropy." courses, marking both the beginning date for social work education in the United States, as well as the launching of professional social work. A number of countries and jurisdictions require registration or licensure of people working as social workers, and there are mandated qualifications. In other places, a professional association sets academic requirements for admission to the profession. The success of these professional bodies' efforts is demonstrated in that these same requirements are recognized by employers as necessary for employment. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Professional associations. Social workers have a number of professional associations that provide ethical guidance and other forms of support for their members and for social work in general. These associations may be international, continental, semi-continental, national, or regional. The main international associations are the International Federation of Social Workers and the International Association of Schools of Social Work the largest professional social work association in the United States is the National Association of Social Workers. There also exist organizations that represent clinical social workers such as the American Association of Psychoanalysis in Clinical Social Work. AAPCSW is a national organization representing social workers who practice psychoanalytic social work and psychoanalysis. 
There are also a number of states with clinical social work societies which represent all social workers who conduct psychotherapy from a variety of theoretical frameworks with families, groups and individuals. The Association for Community Organization and Social Administration is a professional organization for social workers who practice within the community organizing, policy, and political spheres. In the UK, the professional association is the British Association of Social Workers with just over 18,000 members as of August 2015. The Code of Ethics of the US-based National Association of Social Workers provides a code for daily conduct and a set of principles rooted in six core values: service, social justice, dignity and worth of the person, importance of human relationships, integrity, and competence. Topic: <laughs> Trade unions representing social workers. In the United Kingdom, just over half of social workers are employed by local authorities, and many of these are represented by Unison, the public sector employee union. Smaller numbers are members of the Unite the Union and the GMB trade union. The British Union of Social Work Employees has been a section of the community trade union since 2008. While at that stage not a union, the British Association of Social Workers operated a professional advice and representation service from the early 1990s. Social work qualified staff who are also experienced in employment law and industrial relations provide the kind of representation you would expect from a trade union in the event of grievance, discipline or conduct matters specifically in respect of professional conduct or practice. However, this service depended on the goodwill of employers to allow the representatives to be present at these meetings, as only trade unions have the legal right and entitlement of representation in the workplace. By 2011 several councils had realized that they did not have to permit BASW access, and those that were challenged by skilled professional representation of their staff were withdrawing permission. For this reason BASW once again took up trade union status by forming its arm's length trade union section, SWU Social Workers Union. This gives legal right to represent its members whether the employer or trades union congress recognizes SWU or not. At 2015 the TUC was still resisting SWU application for admission to Congress membership and while most employers are not making formal statements of recognition until such a time as the TUC may change its policy, they are all legally required to permit SWU representation at internal discipline hearings etc. <laughs> Social workers in literature In 2011, a critic stated that, "...novels about social work are rare," and as recently as 2004, another critic claimed to have difficulty finding novels featuring a main character holding a Master of Social Work degree. However, social workers have been the subject of many novels, including Bajalian, Chris The Double Bind, a novel first ed. New York, Shea Ehrehart Books. ISBN 978-1-4000-4746-8. Cooper, Philip Social Work Man. Lester, Matador. ISBN 978-1-78088-508-7. Barrington, Freya Known to Social Services First ed. USA, FARAXA Publishing. ISBN 9789995789000. Cooper, Philip. 2010. Witness the Night. London, Beautiful Books. ISBN 978-1-905636-85-3. Fadiman, Anne. The Spirit Catches You and You Fall Down, A Hmong Child, Her American Doctors, and the Collision of Two Cultures. New York, Farrar, Strauss and Giroux. ISBN 978-0-37453-340-3. Irish, Lola Streets of Dust, a novel based on the life of Caroline Chisholm. Currabilly, NSW, El Dorado. ISBN 1-86412-001-0. Greenlee, Sam The Spook Who Sat by the Door, a novel. African American Life. Detroit, Wayne State University Press. ISBN 0-8143-2246-8. Cooper, Philip 
Conrad, Georg The Case Worker. Writers from the Other Europe. New York, New York, USA, Penguin Books. ISBN 0-14-009946-8. Henderson, Smith 4th of July Creek, A Novel. ISBN 978-0-06-228644-4. Johnson, Greg A Very Famous Social Worker. Bloomington, Indiana, iUniverse Inc. ISBN 978-1-4502-8548-3. Johnson, Kristen Unprotected, a novel. St. Butt, M.N., North Star Press. ISBN 978-0-87839-589-7. Kalpakian, Laura Graced Land First Ed. New York, Grove Weidenfeld. ISBN 0-8021-1474-1. Lewis, Sinclair Ann Vickers First ed. Garden City, New York, Doubleday, Doran & Company. OCLC 288770. Mengistu, Dana All Our Names First ed. New York, Alfred A. Knopf. ISBN 978-0-385-34998-7. Sapphire 1996. Push, a novel first ed. New York, Alfred A. Knopf, Random House. ISBN 0-679-44626-5. The basis of the movie Precious, Smith, Alley There But for the, Hamish Hamilton, Pantheon. Unger, Michael The Social Worker, a novel. Lawrencetown, N.S., Pottersfield Press. ISBN 978-1-897426-26-5. Weinbren, Martin King Welfare. Bakewell, Peak Publish. ISBN 978-1-907219-18-4. Fictional social workers in media See also Topic References Topic Further reading Topic External Links Social Work WCIDWTM, the University of Tennessee Social Work Evaluation and Research Resources